we would love to be the, the number one f feeder, the end result, you know, the end of the stream for all the Bryant grads. Uh, one of the problems that mountain sites have today is that we're running out of trainers for the amount of inventory of members that want to be trained. And so it's a great time to be a, a personal trainer and a graduate uh, ready to go in the industry. And certainly not only for Mountainside, but anywhere in the industry. I just think there's a lot of people that are uh, really enjoying the one-on-one -on -one personal training. So it's an exciting time. It's certainly a lot different than when I started 25 years ago. Uh, I tell you what, uh, you know what I learned is how much I didn't know. And I think that was, I think early in my career, I, I would make up for what I didn't know with energy your energy and uh, these days you got to make up for it with just pure knowledge and I think if you're able to combine the two especially at a young age with like kids from Bryant University now uh, it really sets you ahead compared to where I began just doing it pure out of you know gut instinct I, mean, I don't really feel like there are barriers I'm uh, you know I'm anti-barrier so to speak and, and trying to knock down all that we can um, I, I would always want to relay to everybody that the barriers are just within. So if you feel like you truly want to do something, especially in this industry, then you will figure out a way to do it. And, and don't let anything, um, any fears, self-absorbed barriers, what's in front of you get in the way to making whatever it is in fitness that you want to have happen. When I'm looking for somebody uh, to come in to work for Mountainside, I'm gonna just look at their personality first. We could probably teach a Mountainside. Um, and you will learn, and you, as you have learned from graduating, a personal training and certainly fitness aspects. Um, but how do you translate that? It, it doesn't really matter if you cannot translate that. So I'm looking for those kind of uh, sensors that say, hey, you know, this person's got it. They can communicate. They can listen. Uh, they're friendly. They're outgoing. They're going to make me as a customer feel like I want to be there for them.